Hey guys, it's me, Birdie, and um, this is going to be an update to my uh, Mary Maximum uh, Crochet Club box. Um, we made um, this right here, this shawl, this uh, Bella Simo shawl. So here it is, and um, so I was going to show y'all how much yarn I have left and uh, the pattern said that you do one and four color one color four color two color five color three color six so here is what I have left of the the of the yarn so Here's color one, and that's what I have left of color one. Here is color four, and this is what I have left of color four. And this is color two, and that's what I have left of color two. And this is color three. And that's how much I have left of color three. And this is color five. And this is how much I have left of color five. And um, I don't have that much, I don't have any color uh, six left because I went ahead and made a border around mine. It called for a border around one part, of, like the last, the last row was a border but I went ahead and made a whoa sorry about that I went ahead and made a border completely around it so I just did a shell stitch all the way around it so well not the top part as you can see but it is asymmetrical so the bottom one part is this size and the other part is 15 so it's it's maybe mine turned out maybe 60 inches so if I half it here's what half of it looks like and then here's what the other half looks like and here is the border that they Here's the border that I did. I just did an extra shell around the edge of it. I really like it. But this is all I had left that I need to sew in. That's all that I had left of the six. So, that is it. It is really pretty and neutral. And it's really light. But it's not as soft as I thought it was going to be. It's kind of an itchy fabric. But most cottons are itchy. That's why they make good dish towels. Now. For. The extra pattern. Um, you know the other pattern. Of the deal. This is all I had left of the two. Um, of the. Uh, two balls of that one. I just made it into a little deal, but I don't know what I'm going to use it for yet, but that's it. But, um, so we got those two balls, and we we're supposed to make this right here. And it's a really easy stitch, but you only have to, you were only supposed to go to uh, row 19. Well, I went, I, I did uh, 20 rows by following the pattern. And then I did, I didn't want to cut it off because I had, I didn't, don't know what I'd do with that yarn if I just left it. So I did two rows of double crochet and then I did a single row of single crochets over the top because I don't like the rough edges. So here is what this looks like. I don't know if I can get y'all to see it, but it's 74 stitches long, but... So, 
it's like this right here and then it goes all the way to that part so there it is and um, it's really pretty but uh, on the top part So there's the color that it did. So on the top part, do you see, I just did a single crochet at the top. And then on the bottom part, and then on the bottom part, I just did uh, two double crochet rows all the way across. But actually, I really like it. Um, I kind of thought this was soft, but now it's not so soft, but it is really light. So this would be really good if you're going to go camping or something, just to put the chill off of you. So I really thought that was really cool. So those are the two patterns that we did for the month of April. And I need to sew the ends in. I just haven't yet. And I'm not going to today right now. So it still won't be really considered complete. Well, I'm about to try to put it in the little pocket where the deal goes so that was the two patterns for April and um, this pattern was really simple and it went really quick because it was it was the same pattern over and over again it was a, a it was a shell at the beginning and then you did a V stitch all the way across and then you did a V stitch back until you got to the shell. And so it was just the same stitch over and over. So uh, so it was really a fast and quick pattern. And then the one that we got with the yarn, it was really a simple pattern. It um, it was a, a it was um, it was a chain four. And then, uh, and then chain, I mean, chain two, it was, uh, double, it was double, um, it was double crochets and it was, uh, it was double crochet and, uh, and a triple on each side. So it was a triple on each end and it was a double with, uh, two chains in between each set of four. So so it went really quick too because you didn't have to really think about it you just knew you did a triple and then a double and then chain two then four doubles and all that stuff so it went really quick too so i got them done sorry my hair's um wet i just got a shower um and all that jazz but yeah and i thought since i got done with that pattern um i would show y'all and I hope y'all enjoy it. So this was just an update for the Mar for the April box. You already seen the March update because it was the slippers. I need to go back to the February and uh um there's two I haven't done. There's two I'm I'm in the middle of making. Really three. Was it not I know I finished that one shawl, but then I think it was January and February I didn't get those done, and there's two for one of those months, so there's three of them I haven't done, and then I got done with March, and so I got done with April, So, and I need to get done with the Afghan one for uh, Marches, and then, because I already did the other one that I got, because um, that was that big and thick yarn. Um, but I guess that's all. <laughs> I'm just rambling. But y'all have a good morning. And, um, and I hope y'all have a good day. Bye, guys.